Yo, what is up guys? This is Transaner38 coming at you with some more Transformers Titans Return action. And today we're taking a look at the new Transformers Titans Return Deluxe Class Tesla and Brainstorm. Headmaster Brainstorm. Uh, now, I'm not talking about the Brainstorm we had from the Generations line a year or two back. Not this guy. This guy's huge. Uh, not the Voyager. We're talking, taking a look at the new Titans Return Deluxe uh, Brainstorm and Tesla. So, there they are. And this, this mold here is, he's a slight remold and retool of Blur. So, I ain't too mad about that, but Brainstorm really pulls it off. But, again, what could you do, guys? So, moving right along, I do want to thank a good friend of mine for... Sending me these figures. His name is Greg Monroe. He, check him out on Facebook. He's one of my friends and one of my group on my group page too. He always posts uh, sales in my uh, Transformers collection group. So if you guys haven't checked that out, the link will be down in the description below for it. It's my Trans Aaron 38 Cybertronian pit stop. So head on there, and I'll add you on there whenever you guys just want to join the group. So you can see all kinds of pictures and stuff of my buddies post so you know said moving right along here um we got brainstorm here take a quick look at the collector's card same nice piece of artwork here for on the box if i can get to zoom in for you there we go come around the back you got brainstorm autobot tesla's tet specs very nice so those collector's cards. So focus back to earth. Whoop. There we go. Take a quick look at the packaging here. We got brainstorm here in his vehicle mode right there. Nice artwork going on here. With that. Come around the side here, you got the same kind of artwork on the side. Come around the back, you got your obligatory product shots. Tesla transforms in one step, just like Danny Titan Master. You can ride in the cockpit. And uh, there's his vehicle mode. Also sewed separately, Alpha Tron, Autobot Blaster, and Highbrow. And Clobber, which is a Grimlock head. Very neat. So, yeah. I'll get Alpha Tron sooner or later here, fellas. Just, just bear with me. So, moving right along here, we got... Brainstorm in his nice Cybertronian hover jet car thing. I do believe it's a jet, but it does have some landing gear on it here. Wheels just like from Blur. Um, take a look at Titan Master itself. Zoom in, fellas. There we go. Nice little dude. Bring him blurs and you see they share the same mold it's just different paint which is pretty cool but the heads are completely different you know you gotta have different heads um set him off to the side and his weapon is the same that blur comes with very nice it's just cast in that tealish green plastic Right here, take a look at him and uh, Blur together. There we go. You can see where they really did some remolding in these guys, which is pretty cool. They share the same mold. It's pretty neat how they did that. I'm not. I'm not crying about it. You know, cockpit's open. Just the same. So, yeah, very, very much so. But, uh, set Blur off to the side here. Now you can grab him, fold him up, like so, and sit him inside Brainstorm's. 
cockpit. There we go. Close that shut. And he's inside there. Very neat. Um, take down, look at the details on this. I like it says that it's like an orangish yellow. Very nice G1. Nice Autobot decals on both sides. Thrusters. Very nice. It's like the, it's like a, uh, I would, I don't know what kind of like, it's like a brownish gray color. I can't think of the word for it, but again, what could you do, guys? Um, nice laser guns in the front. They don't want to unpeg just like the Generations throw on 30s. Someone's messaging me on Facebook. Now, comparison-wise to the Generations, this guy will probably be up for sale on my page. Um, yeah. He's just way too big, and the transformation is, uh, I don't like it. But it was pretty neat that they did that. You can see how what color dif different they did to that. You can see this is like a darker teal, tealish green, when this is like a light blue. Um, very neat. But uh, the headmasters are completely different the way they did them. So he's a completely oversized version. If I can get them to sit together. Come on. Zoom in. And I think that's how they, they designed these guys here. Because they still share the same kind of concept. I think they just perfected it. Because the ball joint in his head is very loose. And they made better articulating arms. These arms here are just like completely big. But. Yeah. Not the end of the world. Set him off to the side. Zoom back in. There we go. We'll take him off to the side. So I like comparison wise, you already seen Blur. So, moving right along to Robot Mode. Or actually, size comparison with another newest arrival. Mind Wipe. Try to get them in frame here. Wired Wolf. I think they call them... They call them... Uh, wolf Wire now. He was Weird... Wired Wolf or Weird Wolf back in G1? So there's that. <coughs> Forgive me guys, I'm almost done with this cold. I'm feeling a lot better. But again, what could you do, guys? Um, moving right along to transformation. Let's get going with that. We'll set this stuff off the side. Transformation is just similar to blurs. Very similar. What you want to do here is come to the front. Unpeg his arms. Bring him forward. Clip them in. Clip it in. Bring this whole section down. And back. But there's another gimmick here, I almost forgot. You can take this off, just like Blur. Set this back in here. I know it feel look weird like that. But you can bring this in, there's a side. Can't really get to it. There's supposed to be a little landing gear here for that. There we go. You're supposed to peg this in like this. You're supposed to peg your little Titan Master in. So you have like a side gunner kind of thing going on there. But yeah. Fell down in. Yeah, that's kind of weird looking like that, but again. More playability. So it's just similar, just like what Blur's was. Set that off to the side for now if you want. Like we were doing, you know, I just to clap, collapse that in by accident. Bring these up, clip them in, like so. Bring this section back. Come around to the back here to the legs. Swing these out, like so. Kind of like the Combiner Wars 
leg transformation. Grab that little wing here, slide it in. Try try not to put it all the way in. Or it'll catch on the leg. There you go. Bring these down. Bring these down. We're viewing some more detail. Bring this up. Bring this in. And you can see there's an Autobot logo there. When you shut that, it looks pretty neat in there. Bring his arms around. Unpeg the bottom sections of his hands. We flip back. Very hard to get. There we go. There we go. We got him in his robot mode. Now flip uh, him into his Tesla. Tesla. I keep forgetting his name. Um, just flip him in half, just like all the other Titan Masters. Plug him in. There we go. We got the original Headmaster Brainstorm. Now you can give him his shield on this side if you want. There's a port right in here, like so. And I almost forgot for in vehicle mode. Whenever you do have vehicle mode, this does peg in here. Just be careful gun don't push it down all the way because it's hard as heck to get out but there's a shield you can give him a shield over here if you want like so and give him his gun now that is one sweet looking brainstorm you can see some some nice detail there on the wings nice detail on the legs Nice face sculpt. Overall, very cool figure. Now, just like the mold wise, you can see here real quick. I'll transform blur off camera. My flash is turned off on my phone. There's blur. So you can see there's a somewhat of a different same similarity with these guys. I'm not bummed out. You can see the shoulders got remolded on him. New stuff was added. Very neat. Very neat indeed. Set that off to the side. Try to give you guys some light here. The lighting just sucks in my room. <laughs> um, you can see the similarities to these guys. Very neat. I like it that he's actually remold and retool. And just like your Generations Brainstorm. I'll transform this guy pretty quickly off camera. His hands are hard as heck to get out. So hopefully I can get someone to buy this guy off of me. I do believe I'm going to be selling him, so... Here he is in his robot mode. In his tight, well, his headmaster. Transforms, gets plugged in on top. So you can see how big of a difference he is compared to the, the thrilling 30s brainstorm. Very pretty, very, very, very awesome, I would say. Good rep representation of brainstorm. For the Titans return. Very freaking awesome. Um, everyone's been getting these guys early. At Walgreens. Um, I may be a little behind on stuff. 
But, uh, other stuff in life comes first. But again, <laughs> what could you do, guys? <coughs> oh. So, yeah, these guys are pretty neat looking together. But this Titan's Return figure really takes the cake on it. It's very cool how they really did it. I very hope to see some more Titans Return figures. Um, like I said, this is Titans Return Brainstorm. Man, it's pretty cool. Um, for another size comparison, let's bring in his whole Headmaster team so I can have their original Headmasters together. Okay, there's Chrome Dome, Highbrow, one hard head to get in here. Smacking stuff around here. There we go. Got the original Headmasters from the Transformers series from back in the day. That is very cool. I really like this Titans Return line. It's really looking good. We're going to be getting a repaint of him uh, in the ne in this next uh, Wave 3. I do believe it's out now. Um, but I ain't going to be upset about that. But again, what could you do guys? Set these guys off to the side. Final thoughts on this guy. Highly recommend it if you guys are liking the Headmaster series. Um, back in the 80s. Um, very nice G1 homage to him. Um, you can just just see the detail of the wings here from his G1 toy. Um, same way with the sticker de detail here, but that's actually paint. Um, I can't wait to see the triple changer. Uh, op well, it's like the G2 Laser Optimus Prime. Um, hopefully he does come with his G2 sticker sheet. Which would be awesome, but he's actually a triple changer. We're getting the we're getting like the the repaints before the actual figures themselves because again, what could you do, guys? There's nothing you can do. Uh, <laughs> but again, final thoughts on this uh, this guy. Highly recommend it. Um, check your local Walgreens. Check your local local uh, WalMarts. Um, these guys are very cool. Brainstorm is a must-have figure in my book. So, enough said, guys. Enough me dragging on with Headmaster Brainstorm here, the Titans Return. Um, don't forget to rate and subscribe, comment on any videos I do, and keep a lookout for new videos headed your way. Also, don't forget to check me out on Instagram and follow my Facebook page in my collection group, uh, Trans Aaron 38 Cybertrain Pit Stop. There, that link will be down in the description below. Don't forget to check out Web Junior 1977. Game Dungeon Productions, Mike Mouse 74, V Revolticon, and Prime John 1. The links will be down in the description below. See so you now, said guys, this is Trans Aaron 38 talking to you again. Have an awesome day.